Well, you ready to get shocked? Because uh, I was. And I think this is very relevant. And the question is, is the reaction to the most criminalized, disgusting group in America? Now, you might think of it, you could have your guesses. Maybe it's the NFL. Okay. Um, maybe it's Major League Baseball. Or maybe it's even the NBA. Well, it's actually someone else. And this is going to shock you. So get ready. And I want your response to this. Most disgusting sport in this country. Dad, guess which is it? Is it NBA or NFL? 36 have been accused of spousal abuse. Seven have been arrested for fraud. 19 have been accused of writing bad checks. 117 have directly or indirectly uh, been bankrupted at least two businesses. Wow. Three have done time for assault. Wow. 71, I repeat, 71 cannot get a credit card due to their bad credit. What? 14 have been arrested on drug-related charges. Eight have been arrested for shoplifting. 21 currently are defendants in lawsuits, and 84 have been arrested for drunk driving in the last year. It is. How many of you think NBA? How many of you think NFL? Well, the answer is neither. It's the 435 members of the United States Congress. The most. Is that shocking or what? Well, it shocked me. No wonder everything's so crazy over there. It certainly is an eye opener on who's the ones actually running our country. Now, you know, this is something that's made it shocking to me. And I don't think probably a lot of you might even not believe this. So now remember, it's both sides. You know, I didn't break it down on one way or the other. But, you know, as you know, you know, there's no term limits. So, you know, we we have these people damn near a lifetime. Some are in their 80s and have been there. So now you complain about Donald Trump, who's in his 70s, and even Biden. And so you see others. There's probably others there that are older. Some have even passed while in. Don't really need to go into those names, but the Supreme Court is lifetime. So once you're in there, you, you're you the one who has to uh, re resign that. And so, again, it would be hoove us to understand that there should be background checks for all these people. Why are they under these different rules? And why don't we know this? It's because they have the ability to hide. And it very rarely, since the media is controlled by this, then we don't find out. But now if you hear an NFL, uh, Major League Baseball player, an NBA player, any little thing, even in a WNBA, when was the other day? Some lady pushed down uh, Caitlin Clark. I mean, it made all the news. And again, why is this? Why is this disgusting? Well, I think, I think that they put all these other things out to distract us from letting us know who's actually running our money, our our country. So if you, when you all are arguing with each other between whose party's better, you need to look at everyone and to see what's really going on. So a short video, look it up yourself, do your own research, check out some of my other videos here, but just know we should be all in this together and not split apart. So until the next video, have a good one.